Throughout history, people have been interested in the art of painting and have exhibited a development ranging from reliefs drawn in caves to incredible paintings. In this video, I listed the most expensive paintings that have been preserved perfectly without compromising their originality from past to present. The painting named The Standard Bearer is at the bottom of the list. Painted in 1636, this painting is the work of the Dutch Golden Age painter Rembrandt. The painting was purchased by the Dutch government from the Rothschild family for $175 million. The painting is currently on display in Amsterdam. At number 9 is Pablo Picasso's Les Femmes d'Alger, believed to have been created in 1955. The painting had been previously sold for $31.9 million in 1997. When it came up for auction again, it was sold for $180 million. The painting was purchased by former Qatari Prime Minister Hamad bin Jassim. At number 8, there are two paintings because these paintings are sold as a pair. Rembrandt's pair of paintings, Martin Solman's and Upjen Kapit, were made in 1634 due to the couple's marriage. These paintings, formerly owned by the Rothschild family, were sold to the Rijks Museum and Louvre Museums for 160 million euros. At number 7 is Mark Rothko's painting, number 6, Violet, Green and Red, created in 1951. The painting was purchased by Dmitry Rybolovlov for 140 million euros in 2014. The next painting is a richly historical painting called Wasserschlingen II. Painted by Gustav Klimt in 1907, the painting was stolen by the Nazis during World War II. The painting was sold for $180 million to an unnamed buyer in 2015, making it the world's sixth most expensive painting. At number 5 is the abstract expressionist work by Jackson Pollock, titled Number 17A, created in 1948. Kenneth C. Griffin bought the painting for $200 million in 2015. At number 4, there is a painting by Paul Gauguin titled When Will You Marry, created in 1892. The artwork, which had been on loan to the Kunstmuseum in Basel, Switzerland for almost half a century, was sold to Sheikha al Mayasat bint Hamad al Thani in February 2015 for $210 million. At number 3 is a painting titled The Card Players, created by French painter Paul Cezanne between 1894 and 1895. It is also known that Cezanne made numerous preparations and drawings to create the painting. The 5 series painting was sold to the Qatari royal family for $250 million in 2011, and this price was known as the record paid for an artwork until 2017. At number 2, there is the painting Interchange, which has an incredible price of $300 million. Created by Willem de Kooning in 1955, the painting was sold for $4,000 in 1955. Later, in September 2015, it was sold to Kenneth C. Griffin by the David Geffen Foundation for $300 million, and it subsequently took the first place in the list of the most expensive paintings. Before we move on to the last item on the list, please remember to subscribe to my channel to support me. At the top of the list, we have Leonardo da Vinci's painting Salvatore Mundi, which is believed to have been painted between 1499 and 1510. In the painting, we see Jesus Christ wearing a classic Renaissance dress, making a cross sign with his left hand and holding a crystal clear orb in his right hand. It is still a subject of debate whether the painting is entirely original or not, and as far as we know, around 30 variations and copies of this work have been identified. The painting was sold by Christie's in New York on November 15, 2017, for $450.3 million to Prince Badr bin Abdullah al-Saud, setting a new record for the most expensive painting ever sold at an auction.